Food tonight at 10 mosquitoes. They certainly know how to ruin a nice summer evening and given now that it's their peak season during monsoon, the worry for West Nile continues growing across the valley. Yeah, it sure does. And tonight ABC 15 Luz Delia Caballero sharing some tips. These are tips you may not have heard of to fight the bite. We all know about the common hacks to keep mosquitoes away, like dumping out even the smallest amount of standing water or using insect repellent. But what about using these dryer sheets? Here are some hacks that may surprise you. Peak mosquito season is definitely here. Dennis Logan with Mosquito Joe says these pesky insects have two jobs in life. To bite you and to reproduce. He says prevention is the best way to keep them at bay. And we want to make sure that we either eliminate the breeding site or make it one where they can't reproduce. And then the second part is going to be to, to kill the adults, the ones that are biting. But sometimes it feels like no matter how hard you try, you'll never get rid of that buzzing sound around your ears. Here are some hacks Logan says you can try. If you're wearing something tight, it's easier for them to bite through your clothing. So wear loose fitting clothing and make sure it's light in color. Mosquitoes bite mammals. Mosquitoes are going to bite things that have blood and those things are usually darker colored. Put down the beer. There is definitely some some truth to that, that, you know, beer drinkers are, are going to uh, attract mosquitoes. And again, I think it's, the, you know, you're talking about yeast. Mosquitoes are attracted to certain scents, like our sweat, but scents like lavender, citronella, mint, and basil actually repel them. The main component of that is linalool, and that also is found in fabric softeners. Logan says even blowing bubbles can help. I think bring either a fragrance to the area or especially like an oil that they are not going to do well with if they come in contact with it. Garlic also works wonders. If we spray garlic oil on the plants and they land and they ingest it, it will it will kill them. And if you have a ceiling fan or standing fan, turn it on. They're not very strong flyers. They're not like flies. They're not like bees. And Logan says when it comes to providing some relief for the itch, marking an X on the bite, putting on some rubbing alcohol and using saliva, they're all myths. So cooling agents actually help a lot more. Eucalyptus, menthol, toothpaste, hydrocortisone cream is gonna, is gonna go a long way to helping with that. And then honey and oats, uh, soothing properties for the itch. And remember, when it comes to keeping these unwelcome guests away. All of these home remedies do have an impact. You've just gotta have an idea of how much you're gonna need to use to be able to get the effect that you want. Lustelia Caballero, ABC 15, Arizona.